Hi friends! Hello! Welcome back to my channel. Obviously, I'm back again after I think 5 months of uh, being MIA. And to the new viewers, my name is Angel. I'm 50 years old and my channel is about aging. Gray hair and skin. <laughs> but I'm not a professional or I'm not a an esthetician or I'm not a, you know hairdresser or whatever anyway uh this video is about an update of my uh tretinoin use um it's been 17 months since my first uh since i started using tretinoin and i'm still using the same tretinoin it's the uh vitacid which you can find online without prescription, my friends. So I also have one that has prescription. But yeah, I only um I only finished the one with the pres prescription and then I bought this ones. So this is the one with prescription. It just says their tretinoin. I'm using 0 0.1 by the way. Okay, so yeah, to prove to you that I've been using tretinoin for how many months now? I'm using it every night. These are my empties, okay? These ones are the cream form. And this one is the gel. The gel I personally don't like because my skin got uh, more irritated with the gel form. I still have one tube of this, but I don't use it anymore. So I'm only using the cream for the cream form in 0 0.1. I use it every night, pea size, and sometimes I go over a pea size because my skin is already um, retinized or used to tretinoin, so I don't get a lot of irritations anymore or redness. But 17 months have passed, and up to now, I still have like peeling happening on the sides of my mouth or on my uh, cheeks but it's like um only micro peeling that you will never or you can't even notice i'm the only one who can see it so anyways yeah so i'm using tretinoin and then my moisturizers are the charlotte tilbury magic cream i apply this after i apply tretinoin I don't use the sandwich method anymore, which is like moisturizer first and then tretinoin and then moisturizer. So what I do is just I clean my face and then I apply the tretinoin and then wait for um, maybe 20 minutes and apply the moisturizer. So I have the Charlotte Tilbury and Magic Cream and the Embryolis Lay Cream Concentrate. So I just you know um use this to or whatever i want to use each night my skin likes this too kind of like rotate with this too only this too so after the moisturizer i will wait again for 15 minutes or 20 minutes and then i will apply um an oil so I used to use uh, I have like seven different kinds of different kinds of oils but because I like all of them so what I did is I mixed them all together and made my own oil blend or, or oil concoction so I put I blend it here in the Charlotte Tilbury um, serum bottle and this is what i use now seven blends of different oils i have chanel oil here caudalie oil um kiehl's oil true botanical oils uh what else la mer oil and then guerlain oil and also the uh biosans uh rose oil yeah so they are all in here in this um, mix blend i really love this i use this every uh day and day and night so i use only three or four drops 
and just put it on my face to give me that glow and also to at least um, work on with the peeling, especially over here on the sides of my mouth. So look at that glow, my friends. I love it. And uh, what else? So at daytime, whenever I go out, especially when I have peeling, I always make sure to take this with me. I think I've already shared this to you. It's the D'Alba um, First Spray Serum. This really helped me a lot when I was peeling bad. And when I had um, irritation from the tretinoin, this serum is the best for me. So yeah, it makes my skin uh, glowy and moisturized. Just apply a little bit. I have like maybe 10 bottles of this. I love, or my skin loves it. So those are the products that I'm using now, my friends. And my update on my 17th month using Tretinoin. So yeah, I still have a little bit of um, dark spot, but it's already like... Um, improving like it's not that dark anymore because before i started retinoin i'm sorry you can hear my dog because he's barking on the crane bird so before i have this like um uh like a u-shape dark spot on my cheek but now it's gone now this one is a redness because i i was um scrubbing my face with the dry brush so that's why I have redness over here. But overall, I'm happy with my uh, tretinoin journey. My skin has improved a lot. Like it's glowy, it's it has luminosity, and yeah, I love it. So I'm not gonna change my skincare. Maybe from time to time, I will try to use a, a different moisturizer, but for now, I'm really happy with, you know, kind of like rotating between these two. The Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream and the Embryolis Lay Cream Concentrate. Yeah, so for, for the D'Alba, you can find this at, I think, Amazon or eBay. It's a Korean product. But this one, if you have an oily skin, if you don't like like a shiny skin, I don't think this is for you. Because it will make you like uh, dewy or shiny. But I like it that way. So this one, like I said, you can also just search this in Google and you can find it online. Vitacid. So mine is 0 0.1. It has 0 0.025 and 0 0.05, I think. You can just check it out in Google, my friends. So yeah, for the oil, you can use any oil. Mine is this blend of oils. Because I read that you can, you know, combine oils or blend oils if you like to combine it. So that's it my friends, that's my update on my Tretinoin journey, my 17th month Tretinoin journey. I'm so happy with where my skin is at now and I will continue to use Tretinoin 0.1 every night, every day. I hope my video helps those who are, you know, interested in using tretinoin for your skincare and that's about it my friends i hope you enjoyed watching and i miss you i'm happy to be here even if it's only you know not every week anymore <laughs> i love you guys bye bye and thank you so much for watching by the way Bye-bye, guys. Much love from Angel. Mama, chup-chup.